now to the next exercise so if you remember we learned this we learned this exercise so now a variation of this exercise Now the corresponding phrase to that. Re re ga ga ma ma ga ga re re ga ga ma ma pa pa. The only thing is you have to use the fingers, fingering that was used for the exercise, the first exercise that I taught you. So. So it's four notes in a bow. That's another thing. When you bow, as I said, even pressure. even movement you have to play even so the numbers of notes that you play in your bow it it serves the purpose when you play them even when you play them even you will not hear the switching of directions in the bow so it sounds very continuous lesson the two x's x's where i went on one string where i used the second finger and the third finger to play the octave on the scale those two exercises this exercise and two more exercises which i'd be giving you all these have to be played for at least about 6 7 years when you are a beginner you need to play it for 6 7 years and you have to gain speed in this the more faster you get with your fingering the more you going to be technically sound so important thing in this exercise is you do you see the clarity with which i lift my finger and put it back that should be there so you can get as as fast as you want in this so the faster you are able to do this with clarity you're going to be that good in playing anything in the violin <laughs> 